stage adaption of Jack Rosenthal's iconic 1979 TV film directed by the late writer's wife Maureen Lipman in the bar of the Charing Cross Theatre Every overheard conversation involved a list of roads and landmarks. I was in the world of the black cab driver, a close-knit, insular group famous for using the phrase, the cab games finished as many times as they can each day and who were out in force to see the knowledge, Jack Rosenthal's iconic 1979 TV film adapted for the stage by Simon Block and directed by the late writer's wife Maureen Lipman. Nikolai Harthenson's set of street signs had a red, green and amber traffic lights feel to it, with black for the tarmac roads. Alas, someone had spelt orangey wrong on one sign, though I would be surprised if there were any other pedants in the audience to notice. The play opens to Jerry Rafferty's Baker Street to place it in the late 70s, and because it is a relevant title to the topic of potential taxi drivers doing the knowledge, learning every street in central London. We are quickly introduced to the main characters who are trying to improve their lives, and their suffering partners who have to help them retain so much information, and we also pick up some of the history of the trade and the hardships of the knowledge. Stephen Pacey as the tough examiner Mr. Burgess rules the roost at the testing office, as well as commanding the stage in all his scenes as he provokes testees and tries to put them off as they recite their runs. This is not to take away from the other actors who all put in good performances, notably Alice Felgate as the pushy girlfriend demanding her man does something worthwhile with his life, then doesn't like it, when he becomes obsessed with passing out was a cabbie and James Alexandru as Gordon, the spivvy jack of all trades who cheats on his wife instead of learning the roads. Grant Davis, chairman of the London Cab Drivers Club, said, it gave a very vivid portrayal of what it was really like to do the knowledge, an insight that the public are really not aware of. I could feel my hands getting sweaty all over again when I thought of those tests with the examiner. One of the standout aspects of this production was the precision of the 70s attire. Jonathan Lipman no relation had everything spot on the folk rock shows, suits of indescribable shades of brown and mauve, had a chain inducing ties and flare jeans. As someone commented, it was the decade that fashion forgot. It was difficult not to compare the award winning film with the stage adaptation, but doable, and the play fares well in comparison. The knowledge took a lot of the cab driving audience right back to those traumatic times when they were trying to learn 15,000 streets to get the coveted green badge, but a younger audience who don't remember when the black cab ruled the roads will just wonder why in these modern times, when the smartphone is king they don't just use a sat-nav, or why black cabs can't be ordered like Uber. The knowledge is on a chair in Cross Theatre, The Arches, Villiers Street. WC2N6NL until November 11th. Times Mon, Saturday 7.30 p.m. Wed Sat Matinees. Admission £17.50, £35. Phone 08444 950 www.sharingcrosstheater.co.uk.